Welcome back, friends. Our friend Blake Trova is here from Daniel's Vineyard to tell us what's going on out there in October. And they have some new wines that we're going to sample. Blake, welcome to the show. Hi, Love Blake. having you on. Thanks so much for having me back. Good guys. to see you. You bet. It's always amazing when you're here because you guys have such a fun lineup of things going on. We always have something going on. And now that it's fall time, our you know our summer concert series is over. We're going to be uh, introducing a movie series. So we're going to be showing some Halloween-themed movies out under the stars. Nice. So uh, that starts in a couple weeks. So check the website for that. And you guys can actually have some input on what films they're showing. Oh, that's cool. Uh, so you can go on there and vote uh, and uh, check that out. And you can sit under the stars, drink some wine, yeah. and uh, have a beautiful evening. Man, it is perfect? such a beautiful venue if you've never been. Yeah, Where exactly is. is it for someone who's never been? So we're been? in McCordsville. We're yeah. just outside of Indianapolis on the northeast side. We're in the kind of Fishers and Geist area. Yeah. So we're really accessible to a lot of different mm -hmm. areas. 25 minutes from downtown. Yeah. So, yeah, it's, a, it's, it's a truly a, an escape from the city life. So. I know. It really feels like you're somewhere else. And I yeah. love the little fire pit. Like you were saying, this is the time of year you might want to sit around the fire with one of these. Yeah, what absolutely. Today? Absolutely. So, uh, you know, it is fall, especially this morning, as you get that little nip in the air. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we're loving it. So, people are transitioning away from the summertime whites and roses, going into the heavier reds. Uh, so, I brought a Maldeck that uh, we just bottled yesterday. It's going to oh. be released yesterday. very soon. Yeah, okay. so this is our. 2022 Malbec. Yeah, cheers. cheers. I love that all of us just did the spinny thing. Now, Blake, you're a legit winemaker, but Jillian and I just picked it up and kind of did a little <laughs> swirl. Yeah, step. so you got to release those aromatics. That's what that's doing. It's kind of, uh, you know, introducing some oxygen into the wine and allows yeah. the aromatics to really come out. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah, so this is 2022. Like uh, yeah. Grapes come from California. That's the unique thing about us at Daniels is we have a 22 acre vineyard and we grow some varietals that can grow in Indiana and mm -hmm. we make wines out of those. Mm -hmm. We also source more traditional traditional varietals like Malbec, yeah. Cabernet Sauvignon, Chardonnay. Uh, we source those from the West Coast. We get in whole grapes and we crush, destem, and ferment those just like they're grapes that we grew. Um, so we get the opportunity to make yeah. wine from Indiana and kind of more classic varieties from Super California good. like Malbec. Uh, this was aged for uh, about 10 months in okay. American oak yeah. barrels. That's yep. what kind of gives it some of those baking I can spice. Taste that. Like, uh, oh. Yeah, you get a little bit of yeah. vanilla kind of mm -hmm. notes. Um, so yeah, it just got bottled yesterday and will be released very soon. Nice. I'm and if you want, yeah. uh, if you want to get uh, all of our new releases, you need to join our seller club. Ooh. Yes. Uh, they always get first dibs at all of our releases, uh, including our upcoming blackberry wine all and right. cherry wine. Let's try that oh, one. Yeah, we are known this. for our drier wines at Daniels, but we also like to make sweet wines uh, for the people with that palate. And also, sweet wines have a place. You know, with dessert, you know, this cherry wine would be fantastic with yeah. like a fudge Ooh. brownie or something yeah. with dessert. You could drink it chilled, you could drink it warm, you could drink it at room temperature. Uh, made with uh, ripe Michigan cherries, Ooh. Ooh. Uh, just treat. sweet enough, yeah. but you get that, you know, beautiful cherry note. Got a nice um, kick to yeah, you know, nice little kicks. 12% mm -hmm. alcohol, so it also warms you up from the inside, if you know it. what I'm That'll saying. Do That'll do it. I know what I'm saying. <laughs> Nice so, little fall night in Indiana so, with a glass of this. Exactly. You got you grab the dryer drinkers, you can grab the Malbec or cherry wine, sit out by a fire pit, watch a movie. It's fun. Yes. We got it all. And you have some great food there too. Absolutely, yeah. We do artisanal pizzas. We have yeah. a wood fire pizza right in the right in the tasting room. It's good. Uh, beautiful charcuterie and salads and oh, all oh, kinds hi, of stuff. Welcome in. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. You've seen her steal food many times on the show. We love it. We, we actually prefer when she steals the food or wine. But it's yeah. always well, Tessa, good? Yeah, she's off. That there. means she loves it. If What's she runs away with She took it and ran away. Yeah. What's the story with the dog? I see him on your merch a lot. Oh, yeah. yeah, so he is a, you know, we're a family owned business and he is just part of the family. Yeah. And uh, Windsor, a German for winemaker, he's oh. a German short haired uh, pointer and as uh, just kind of our mascot. That's He's cool. been around since they planted the vineyard back in 2010. Yeah. And, uh, you know, uh, we love to have him around. He's a little senior dog, too. So yeah, exactly. He's been exactly. That long. Well, it's yep. truly such a beautiful space, like you were it saying. Is, yeah. So if you guys want to check it out, go to the website, and then it would be fun to vote on those movies. Yeah. Like Absolutely. You were saying. And then come so. out and hang out, check it out. Yeah. Bring the family, bring love the it. dog. Say hi to Blake Perfect while you're setting. out there. Absolutely. Yeah. Blake, Thanks so thank much. You. Look forward to seeing you. Awesome. Cheers. Cheers. I like them both, but this one's my favorite. I gotta say. I'm going Malbec too. It. The cherry. Yeah. I'm, I'm usually not a sweet guy, but I did like the cherry. It's, it's amazing. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, Blake. Cool. Yeah, still Cheers. to come. Chris Lloyd from the Film Yap is here with his list of six must-see movies at the Heartland Film Festival. Stick around, friends. We'll be right back. There he is, looking sharp as always. <laughs>